third place no matter what. Round begins in if I'm not mistaken. Three, two, I'm at third place one. no matter what. Uh, uh, yeah. Oh, I can't confirm. Don't, don't, call, don't ask difficult questions right now. Let's get this game going. It's the final match of Group B at the Beat Invitational. I'm on Razy to begin with. Do note that Tox is not rocking the clutch. He's gone with Doom, Ranger, Galena, whereas Razy is with the Galena, Clutch, and Nyx. Alright, Avic is sec- uh, sorry. Clara's second of Razy wins? Wait, no. I was listening to Rafford. Don't self, do not listen to Rafford just yet, because even he finds it difficult to Avic, figure out this Because Avic lost to Toxic, so <laughs> Toxic would- Or, because Avic lost to Cooler. No, beat Cooler. Let's so. cast the game, Whatever. Jason. Let's cast yeah, the game, ahead. and we'll do it after. <laughs> Help totem initiated. I'm still just listening to, to rapper at the moment. I know, I'm still, trying to, I'm still trying to calculate it right now, actually. <laughs> right, well, we've got uh, three totems down for Razy already. He's been largely living in that mega room and is eventually exploring the rocket platform. will get himself on the Mega. There's going to be Tox pushing back. Fear the Tribalt of Toxic. Death is the only Actually, Avic did be cooler, so Avic would be second. <laughs> god damn it. Oh my god. Oh my god, man. Alright, so Raises Galena has four totems down, most importantly. That's. Yes. Yes. Toxic hasn't been able to really disrupt any of this just yet, which he's doing on purpose. You can see, actually, I switched to his point of view. He saw it, and he's using yeah, this as an ability that. to actually not give away his position by destroying them. Vicky heard another totem go down over there. He's going to have to be really careful if he decides to go towards Lightning Gun. We'll spot him again. He's still got the starting machine gun, so really just getting to that side of the map has been very difficult. And smart of Razy to want to deny that lightning gun. Bit of tri-bolt damage. Exchange for some rocket damage from Razy. Tox has got to know he can't go through the teleporter. He's gonna jump up. Oh my god, he gets the dire orb. Oh no, the double totem! They still hadn't faded from uh, uh, Razy's previous life. So they're gonna go straight into a fight over there. 11 health left and Razy's going to take him down. Oh, the grave disappointment for Tox after the success of getting the first frag. That Just is, hate uh... to see that happen, don't you, Zoot? Yeah. No good coming guy. in. Two seconds on Mega. Razy. Not gonna be able to go for Mega this time, but. <clears throat> At least gets a shield back up because of those time shards. So, trading Mega for a shield, I think that's gonna be worth it. And with how quick he's getting around the map, I don't think Toxic's gonna have an opportunity to get a lot of these totems down. Shield comes in, rockets as well. And Tox can say goodbye oh. here. As Razy's gonna get the three one victory so far in that round. Oh my god. If if those totems had faded already, I think he had to wait maybe another second and he would have been fine. It could have looked very differently. But you know what? You can't you gotta blame Tox for that. He should have rocket jumped up or used a different entry to it. He should he should have figured that there'd been so much time, like there were certainly more totems around. We got Nyx this time though from Razy, who's, who's already used his Ghost War. Right at the beginning. This is very, very dangerous of him, but his lightning gun is just keeping him in the fight. Oh, despite being those this week. One rocket could have ended it right there, but he doesn't have him, unfortunately. And Razy coming through the teleporter with 24 health. Still somehow dodging the damage that Toxic's throwing out. It's a little bit more HP in there. He's gonna get heavy off the back of this, but still really close. And 10 seconds to go on his ghost walk. to be healthy now, but you can still see these rockets just barely grazing by him, almost catching him out. Yeah, feel that damage quite a lot. Good heavy machine gun, actually. That's extremely useful for him. Would like to see Toxo challenging for heavy armor next. The Dire Orb comes out. There's going to be the Mega in a moment. Can he survive for a second longer? That's going to be a no. I don't like the Dire Orb usage there from Tox. He's going to respawn with Doom. And that is going to mean Razy getting a lot of items. Got to be careful here, though. Doom's on the chase. Doesn't have to go swap up. Looks like he will create some distance, though. 
will stay healthy. He's denied a lot of these big pickups. It's not to mention he can transition from Mega over to Heavy Armor if he can just get this one cleanly, though. I don't think Tox gonna let that happen. Comes onto the high ground. Berserk gonna be popped in. He doesn't have the time on Mega. Mega's gonna be picked up by Razy. Heavy up in two seconds. <laughs> <laughs> he was just taking damage and there was, there was nothing. Oh, you still can't select weapons. Good rocket damage, though. And gets the heavy afterwards. So although that was a bit awkward over at Mega, he's transformed it into something very, very positive. There's 10 seconds until Razy can get a hold of that uh, Ghost Walk again. Yeah, we can see, though, he's been able to buy the time. Mega up. Don't think he's going to contest this one. Yeah, he's going to hear that one taken. Eight seconds on Heavy. I think Tox should know this. It's Toxic ideally going to be heading over to Heavy to go for the contest. We try to force up this Ghost Walk again. Comes in from the high ground. Goes to the Teleporter Razy. Ghost Walk can be used to avoid that rocket. And Heavy going to be picked up. Tox didn't even take that much damage. He could have continued to push. I, don't think, I think he felt that. Wow, what a rocket. <laughs> I think he felt that Heavy was taken already. That's why he didn't push back down. Must know where he is. Goes under the LG. That was a very slick rocket jump. Gonna find a bit more damage. Actually, he's created an opportunity to tie up the champion score. And that ghost walk has returned. Oh, he didn't want to use it at all, though. But Toxic finds the dunk. Gonna go up against uh, Clutch now. But fortunately for him, Razy falls a little bit and he can go elsewhere. Does he re realize he's just down below? Also, we'll fortunately for Toxic, he picked up rockets right before Razy could, because that almost would have spelled Doom for him. As you know, he's playing Doom. Anyways, picks up Mega <laughs> Razy. <laughs> Having to be up in a few seconds. Taking a lot of damage, but he still wants to push this situation. I'm actually just going to give up on this one back away. Maybe go towards Heavy now. Keep the stack going. Not to mention, he has a shield back up. That's oh, a great pre time oh. rocket. 38 HP left. He's going to have to pop a shield. He does, but does he have the health HP <laughs> to survive? And, well, Toxic is going to suicide. He just gets rid of his life very quickly, though, right? I can go in on this now and get the uh, the frag fast. Galena versus Galena now. Clutch has managed to get through. Sorry, uh, Tox has managed to get through the clutch ordeals. Which uh, which horse do you have in this race? Uh, I'm gonna have to say Razy, but no, don't make me pick. That's unfair. I don't know. I think I already did. I think Tox is, Tox is making some nice aggressive moves at the moment, so I'm, I'm kind of feeling they, you know, it's a coin flip situation, Jason. That Ryan, that's a lot oh. of damage from the rocket. No way he can contest the Mega now, and Toxic might be able to get over towards Heavy from this. Yeah, uh, Razor's gonna back off. Does Toxic have the timing? Yeah, yeah, I know, he sees it up. Who knows? Who knows? There's one totem up for Razy. Almost a third going to be up for Tox now. Oh, I say that. I mean, he's already had one deleted. Tox definitely be aggressive. Well, Tox is keeping that stack really well. Razy's just trying to claw back and get some armor here. We're going to hit that sudden death, but it's already sudden death anyway, so it's not like it's going to matter too much. Death. I'll get a bit of uh, machine gun damage going over there. The heavy is up, and uh, Fox has been a little bit absent minded just then. Has to keep a uh, an eye on the timing, but his rockets have been amazing. There's going to be a totem there to help him out, but he's going to push past. There's so much range. Had to have switched to the machine gun. And Racy will claim mega health. Trying to be safe how he gets over to armor, too. Since he knew, or should know exactly what it is, since he picked it up himself. On the high ground, though, it's going to be toxic, and he already spots him out. 72 damage rocket was fantastic. Heavy will be picked up. The damage is still coming in, and Razy doesn't want to let this one go. He wants this kill. Toxic is so low in HP, and Toxic will go down, wow. and Razy will get the round. The LG from Razy just then. He managed to get early on that angle. Quick, we moved over to the other hallway into the heavy room. And Tox just seemed, I don't know, he's f just fumbling a little bit in that fight. And I think the, the, the click on the rocket probably threw him off a tiny bit. Oh, we're going to see Clutch be... Ranger. Rocket going to be picked up for a raise, but you know what? Does he need to use the shield? Has a health pool to fight with. And Toxic already going to be down a champion. I'm switching over to Doom, and it's Toxic's last chance in this map. And there's going to be a shield coming out. 
And they're gonna be another kill for Razy in 20 seconds. Escalade has got to do everything for Tox. I don't doubt that he's going to try, but he needs to close the gap quickly. Heavy up in a moment. He's hit some good damage. And he's going to chase onto Mega also. It gets taken by Tox, but the rockets are going to be good enough. He only has 24, 24 health. health. Oh, there's going to be a load of health bubbles over here. He's also going to be able to but get Nick's the token back up. Oh, Razy. One more rocket could have finished him off here. Now, Razy actually might lose another champion. Tox might be back in this one. Razy, smartly enough, going to actually sit down below and not go through the teleporter, but he's still being chased on. He's still being aggressed on, and he's going to be dropped. Toxic in another 30 seconds of time has responded, and we're down to the horse race yet again here. Galena v. Galena. Did not expect Toxic to come back in this round, honestly. Yeah, that was, that was fast. Uh, in, in some sense, uh, Razy's given him a bit of a gift with that aggressive play. Loads of rockets in the wall just getting in the way of what could otherwise have been an amazing shot. Oh, the totem, though. This is very, very good news for Tox. Is he going to try and go in on this? He has to respect. Oh my lord, one Razy health. has one health and he doesn't have tone for another 10 seconds. He's going to get Mega in the nick of time to keep him alive. But again, he's locked into the story. He's going to have a totem up for himself to heal up with. But he's still down in armor and he's not hitting the shots. He's got the rocket coming out, LG coming out, Tox is looking to push in. Tox is going to have his own totem in 8 seconds of time. Picks up an own health bubble. He's got the health advantage. He's got the armor advantage. Well, certainly he should be able to get the round here. Does he want to push is the question. He goes in with another totem. The rocket lamp is a, such a sick rocket from Razy. He could turn this fight around with the lightning gun. 20 health left. The mega's up in a second. And Tox will get it. There could be another totem by the teleporter exit. And eventually the stalemate has broken off. And Tox uh, realizes, I'm going to go back, get heavy, and try to create a safer engagement. I don't know how Razy escaped that, but he stayed calm, cool, and collected there. He's back in the same spot yet again now. LG gonna lock him in place. Rocket jump up, catches him off guard. He's careful with the totems to not get into him. And that's gonna be the chase out of Razy. Totems for days he for actually, both these players. He actually comes back through the teleporter. That's so gutsy when he could have had a way out. LG now, Razy takes him to 32. Rocket is gonna miss. Uh -oh. And the heavy's gonna be up. Oh, he's got the wrong weapon out, and Razy gets the LG. Hox did not expect him to just well, come out from the mega area like that towards heavy. That's unfortunate for Toxic. He fought so hard back into that round, getting two frags down he to did. his last champion. Like you said, getting caught out with the wrong gun in hand. A little bit unfortunate, and that's not something Tox does often. Having the wrong weapon no, out. Indeed. Indeed. So uh, we will move over LG to... for Razy, by the way. Ooh, that's tasty. Yeah, I don't know how Razor was able to survive all that time up by Mega. Tox just didn't feel, like, comfortable enough to just push through and go for it. I mean, he was at risk, like, it could go wrong. There could be a mutual frag. Who will get the mutual frag first? Will I just straight up die? There are totems there. I don't know the exact positioning of everything. It's like he couldn't control the situation as precisely as he would have wanted to. Sorry, just telling the admins to try to get the... Uh... Special thing fan of the show, but I don't think there's any way that could happen. So we're going on to our next map. It's going to be Blood Covenant here. Yes, that's right. This is going to be Tox's pick. Curious to see what he's going to be picking. We've seen some mod picks from him uh, this tournament. Um, but we'll find out. Camping composition should begin in 10:15. Uh, By the way, guys, if you're just wondering why uh, Zoot is not blinking, um, he actually had surgery in his eyes, and he's not allowed to blink. For the next 27 hours so uh it's really hard, but yeah or move actually he's, he's practicing his ventriloquy or maybe i'm practicing that um no it's uh we're having some issues so to keep his mic quality high we decided to end the video call to make sure to you know make sure everything in game is good for us yeah i am wholeheartedly apologetic towards the guys watching for the robo zoo earlier but uh People's hopefully we'll increase saying the quality those people are strange <laughs> Nothing else to say. Uh, what we're getting here from Tox, we're getting Nyx, Ranger, and Visor. Again, going to go with the no clutch plays. And he's been, he kind of started the tournament a bit with clutch, but then quickly kind of moved away from it. Kilson, really the only person in the playoff bracket who's not a clutch player. Like, at all. As I was saying uh, to you, uh, he just doesn't feel good enough of his clutch. Well, maybe five that's days the same instance for 
for for Toxto in general, even though he's been playing a lot more. Yeah, Kozo said for at least five days, he doesn't feel like it can be on the level of, you know, Scythe or Razy. But Blood Covenant, this could be the last map. Toxic could be out. Shield comes in immediately. Razy has shield. Doesn't even need it. And that visor just being demolished off the get-go. So what I find strange about that is that Tox has visor. You use the piercing sight off the beginning. When you know there's a clutch in your opponent's composite cha champion composition, you can tell, should I go to rockets? Possibly one of the most popular places on the map. Or not. And he chose to go there. Oh, he's there again. Another rail gonna land. 100% accuracy so far for Razy. Ghost Rock not being used just yet. Talk to trying to save this one. And, well, he's still low on life. And the shield is back up for Razy. Yeah, Razy just checking there's no uh, Ghost Walk shenanigans. Avoid any form of perforation. Razy just dancing around the map at the moment with clutch. 10 seconds or so till the major items come back up. Trying to lock him down somehow. He's like the fastest, I don't know, patrol ever. <laughs> He's Robocop. <laughs> Ooh. Though Toxic's nice laying on a lot of rails. I don't think Razy's gonna be able to get over towards Mega in time. Stop this from being taken, especially with the rockets raining down from above. Back up to the high ground. Again, Toxic gets another rail. That's two back to back. Toxic's accuracy is really starting to work out for him here, and Razy might have to think about using the shield sometime soon. Razy's setting up for heavy. Just gotta watch out. Rails will be incoming. Tox needs to hit something. Razy. Oh, the ghost wolf. Does it come out in the end? I yeah, think he it used did. it. Yep. And the shield came in as well to Razy, so both of those being popped, though Toxic has to be even more careful. 10 HP left. Going for the shards first, then to pick up the health on the back of that. Spots out Razy. I don't think he was. Seen just yet though, but there's the mega health. You should have caught eye of him just then. Or he hears him at least. This is not going to be good. Finds a couple of uh, power glasses. Fox has got to be incredibly careful, but Razy has no shield, so he's also can't overcommit to fights until about now. Oh, oh. the ghost walk immediately. Razy doesn't want to use the shield. He now knows, hey, I can go back in on you. I, I'm actually amazed that Toxic went for any sort of engagement there. But hey, he pops the shield. Razy isn't able to capitalize off of that. And now they're equal in abilities again. Tox is right behind, actually. He popped through the teleporter for a moment and then darted away. Tox, sorry, uh, Heavy up next. Tox went up the bridge and then back down. Rail for him. He can still land more. He's going in with the lightning gun. Now the shield's still not going to be back up, but he's pushing anyway. Razy's uh, clutch falls. And now we have Nyx versus Nyx. I'm on Tox's point of view now. He's got one rail left. Rails. Okay. Razy into yeah. that. I would say I don't think he realizes he doesn't have another shot. Nope. Goes back for the rail again and doesn't have any ammo left in this one. So a little bit of a misstep from him. Gonna go and pick up the rail ammo now. And here's exactly where Razy's gonna be. From his Razy has an advantage in Ghost Walk too. Yeah, definitely. That's a good rail actually to keep him away. And now getting the hourglasses also, he can challenge towards this mega. Oh man. Alright. Alright, let's get some more of these going, Tox. These are nice rails you're hitting. I'm gonna find him one more time. Both of them go to walk at the same time. And he's like, right, I want to be as close to you as possible. Who got it? Doesn't matter, it's suicided. Oh, okay. I freaked out. I thought that was the last champion each. <laughs> oh, right, Jason, my heart went oh, there. Oh, my it's God. toxic! <laughs> They're both thinking the same thing over here. <laughs> All right, then. Round begins in three. Two. Tox is in. One. Round two. Fight. Well, not only does he have to win this map, he has to win the third, which will be Blood Run. Clutch. Oh, that's Ooh. gonna be 100 damage now done. He gets Razy to drop, too. Best. Well, he gets Razy to, 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 to drop, so Tox doesn't have to worry about the shield anymore. He's gonna have Rail, too, but he doesn't hit that shot. He has a good opportunity. He hasn't used Piercing Sight yet, either, so kind of the same misstep he played in the first round, but luckily this time it didn't punish him.
decent just before the uh, shield returns. Doesn't catch eye of him down below, but he's got time to get himself back over towards the heavy and continue this pressure. We well, he heard him. <laughs> I've never seen Clutch running away from someone like this. <laughs> Usually it's him the one chasing. But Tox was really focused on Razy for a moment then, when he should have gone towards the heavy. I, I really think that Tox's timing is a bit off, which is preventing him from getting the most out of these engagements. Razy there was really confident he, after getting the heavy. He was like, right, I got the shield back as well. Let's push into a fight. Visor is weak. Again, those time shards. 14 seconds on his shield. Just playing this one slow, realizing, let me just wait this to come back up. Toxic even tried to go for the jump onto bridge there, or maybe... No, actually, I don't know what he was doing. Maybe he was trying to go for the jump, which would have been a little bit uh, ill-advised. Nice little fadeaway rocket at a Razy 2, 59 damage. He's on the chase now. The Ghost Walk's gonna have to pop. The rail's gonna hit. He pops the shield to see where he's gonna go. And he spots him jumping across. But can Toxic keep his distance? He drops down below. And he does successfully get the juke for a oh. second, but no, Razy catches out. He smells the blood. I don't even know if robots can smell. But he gets a chase down on Toxic <laughs> and gets the kill. Full stop. Try ball. Oh, the double. Tries to go for a bit more over here. He's going to go through anyway, looking for rockets, and he's going to find it. Finally gets rid of that clutch. Now it has the rail. There's a heavy. There's a heavy, Tox. Please go for the heavy. He's not going for it. Well, neither is Razy at the moment. None of them know it's up. Well, the only reason he wouldn't go is like if he thinks he's at risk of the spawn. But I mean, he could have got her away. I'm pretty sure in time. Look at Razy though. He's trying to set up a little bit of a bait there, a little bit of a trap. Set backs off. He doesn't get heavy. He didn't even check heavy. And you know what? Tox gets both. So a good chance he can come back into this one, especially if he keeps hitting dire orbs like that. For sure. Coming down low. To the catacombs. I think the LG versus LG fights between Tox and Razy are also awesome. Definitely consider Razy up there with one of the best aimers right now. Speaking oh, of Razy, up behind. Yeah, oh. that's not good. I was a little bit worried there that Tox would let the Dyrob overshoot the armor and he would fall off the map for some reason. <laughs> I, that's something I would that's do, 100%. It's a big overshot, really. <laughs> You gotta go pretty wrong to make that happen. At least this time though, Razy does get Mega. LG comes out from both players. Toxic keeps him in the air actually. Bounce him over to the other side. Use the Dyer, comes through the rocket as well and he gets the frag again. Toxic coming from behind another time. And he gets the respawn, he gets the rail. And Razy, he went for the chase, but now he's gonna have to back away. Yeah, Razy's at risk of uh, or being or putting Tox on a match point. This is well, map point. quite a scary position for him. Yeah, sorry, map point. Like, like match that. point. That's that gets even more We're scary. Not there yet. We still We're have one more map to go, so, or potentially one more map. Oh, rail almost connecting there out of Tox too. I mean, as we said before the match started, this is Tox playing for his tournament life at the moment. If he loses this, he's oh, out no, of the crazy. tournament. Crazy, crazy, a great shot. Stuck around for the perfect amount of time. Orb comes through. Gonna be able to pick up the heavy, but eats a rail for that. Heavy or Mega is gonna be up in a second, but Toxic wants the kill. He wants more damage done. And oh, you gotta be careful if you're Razy. Yeah, go high ground. Don't be don't be railable here. And he does just barely escape this, so he gets away with heavy. Gets Mega. But Toxic still has Dire Orb up. And again, we've seen what it's already been able to do for him in this matchup. But it's scary still for Toxic with this amount of health and armor. He's walking around the map, ignoring the health bubbles, but he's just kind of checking. Am I going to get pounced upon, or am I safe? Here's a bounce pad. Tries to see if he can get a rail shot out. Not going to be the case. He can't really pay attention to the heavy armor. He can't afford to even, like, find an angle that he could get damage from. Ooh. Door, dire orb now down. And we're in sudden death. Sudden death. We're already there anyways. The one champion apiece. 15 seconds on heavy. Toxic might look to stick around for this one. And Razy actually dropping down. Come around the corner. Dyro comes through again. That's just behind Toxic. He's going to go for the jungle. Dyro comes in out of oh the rock God. as well. He's not going to let him. Razy comes back wow. and gets the kill. To be Pretty honest, cool. though, Razy, that was not a convincing Repair round fight. victory at all, considering you're up 2 to 2 to 0. And you still round lost two champions yourself. Really well Three. done by Toxic were, to get back into two. it. 
There were two options there for Tox in that fight. Front. Do I go for the Dire Orb up to the mid platform as he's dropped and, you know, continue to survive for a bit longer? Or do I go balls out and try to pick up the frag with the Dire Orb? He went for the latter and it uh, oh. did not work for him. It's a lot of rails being done here, but that's a lot of damage out of a shotgun. Ouch. That was 100 plus, and Toxic gonna be punished here. Not to mention, Razy picked up Heavy and Mega. Oh. Maybe a stacked robot here, and he's got shield up again. Super stacked. Strong with an LG, but this is the wrong time to go for it. He's gonna keep the lightning gun out, and Razy's trying to chase this. Shield is gonna last for long enough. And now Tox has got to do the work again with Ranger. Just find a rail. Oh! Goes for the and the direct. That's a sub minute round. And now Tox. Now Tox has to focus. I can respect, by the way, that that uh that dire or play right there. Because he knew exactly where he'd be on the jump pad, right? He just mistimed it just a tad, tad too late. I'd like to see Tox playing with something that isn't uh visor. Oh, got uh, your, first champion. You got your wish. Oh, goody, goody. I thought we were getting But now we've Thanks got a punch like in his face and no die orb for Tox to get away. But you know what? Oh. He doesn't need to get away because he's got a nail gun. And look at the amount of <laughs> HP no he had difference. left. I don't know how he survived with that much health. Fair play to him. Nail gun, powerful. Now it's going to be um, Razy getting himself over to a railgun. Very, very nice shot. Heavy's going to spawn in a second. He's trying to wall jump up again. He might even have the zoom out. Oh, the nail gun. He flies into the air. Almost gets the kill from that. Did not think he could get so airborne. Fox is looking good now. Two good solid first kills. Visor first seems to not be uh, as positive for him. Still got one champion to find. We've seen Toxic come back from these kind of situations when he was down two. And Razy might be able to do the same though. It's the orbs on cooldown. These rockets will give Toxic just just over a minute. Minute eight. But gets the round nonetheless. And we're in our fifth round here on Blood Covenant. Again, if Toxic wins this, we go to a third map. If he loses and Razy wins it, Razy's through and Toxic's out. Well, Razy's already through, but Toxic's out. Fight. Crunch time, Tox. Focus. I think we want another map, so I'm going to watch him now, uh, figure out what I can do. He's got his trusty tribolt. We're finally picking up some of the other weaponry too. You can see that Razy moved over. Ooh. Wow. And he's ghost walking in. a reaction. Toxic can kind of sense that with his sixth sense. Gets the die orb, but the die orb's not going to connect and Razy's going to get the kill. The aggressive play working out for him here. Now he's up one champion. Oh, the respawn comes back in. Razy's just going to back off instead. Wants to pick up armor in a couple of seconds time, though. Toxic won't give it to him for free. He's spamming away with the MG. Armor's picked up. Rail looking to land on Razy. He connects. He's on swan HP. Just oh take out your God. machine gun, but it doesn't oh matter. The rail's going to be there. And Toxic no. is one champion away from being knocked out of the entire tournament. Well, I'm going to go back over to Tox uh, view then and... See what I can do. This could be the last time we see him play in the Beat Invitational. Got all the weapons very quickly, but he's got all the hard work to do with Mix. There's one rail. He's going to need at least a couple more. Oh. Wow. Finds an angle somehow. That was a remarkable shot. That's not a shot you hit every day of the week. Unless you're Tox, then, then maybe you do. Right above him though is going to be Razy. And Razy, well, I actually has the HP, but Tox, I'd be very careful. I don't think, no, the real is available for Razy. Armor respawning back in, and Tox going to take the high ground position from the rocket launcher. Oh, I misses the jump, yeah. but is that going to affect him right now? Ghostwalk was used by Razy, by the way. Both of them using it. We got a strong read from Tox if he realizes that it has been used. But he's got to be careful because he needs the entry damage. Razy, he's going to drop on him right now. Direct rocket, but it's not enough to save him. So Razy picks up Blood Covenant 3 2, locks down first place in the group. Direct swap in the semi finals tomorrow. 
I think we believe that is Tox out of the tournament. Yeah, and honestly, credit to Tox, like seeing him play at the end there, especially on this map, the, the amount of shots he was pulling off, the die orbs he was pulling off, he definitely rose to the occasion.